We're here at the Annie rehearsal. We've been rehearsing for Annie about uh, for about two months here at the old old Village Hall. Getting ready to take the show on the road to Sandburg shortly and uh, get uh, the show in full production. So we've uh, we wanted to interview one of the most talented cast members uh, in Orland Park and in the Annie show. We've got with us today Mr. Dan Nevinger. Hi, Dan. How are you? Okay. How are you doing today? Not too bad. Thank you. We've uh, I, I've I had the pleasure of working in uh, in the same cast as you back at Christmas Carol, and just amazed at your versatility. And I'm amazed at your versatility with what you're doing here. How long you've been working? How long have you been working with the Orland Park Theater Troupe? Uh, well, actually, I started when I was about 15, going on 16. Uh, randomly came across an ad for tryouts and said, "Yay, you know what? Let's give it a shot." And uh, worked with Fran for the first time, Jemmy, and then it just kind of stuck. Took a little break when I went away to school, but came right back. So you've done a lot of different theater. You've mm -hmm. done Orland Park, the Orland Park Theater Troupe. Mm -hmm. Now you've done some other shows too. Oh, I've I've done it in high school. I've done it in Joliet. I've done it in Lamont. I've done it in uh, over Governor State. Um, I just got done doing it with JPEG Theater. I was Legally Blonde. Yeah. So. Yes. Yes. So you've uh, you are uh, destined for greatness. Meh. In the theater, true. The it, it's world. a hobby. It's fun. Yeah. I love it. Yeah, but it's uh, you do you 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 just you can seem to be able to step into any just about any role. You must have played three or four different roles in Christmas oh, yeah. Carol. Oh, you yeah. were you were you and I you, was an you old man, yeah, young guy, and then some crazy yeah. goof guy. So. Yeah, and you played them all very well. Mm -hmm. You did a tremendous job with them all. Now, something else you did recently. What, tell us a little bit about the experience of being in the video, which is going to become the signature video for Orland Park, and you're probably the top. <laughs> person in it. I won't tell Fran that though. Well, um, I was at, they wanted another male voice and they asked me literally the night before, hey, you know, are you free? We're f uh, filming this music video and it's going to sponsor different things from Orland. And I'm like, okay, sure. So they're like, we need you to learn this song. So I literally had maybe four hours before to learn this song and they're just like, all right, come and sing it. And then we filmed it. I was, I believe, on the front porch of uh, Mayor Humphreys long ago on his front porch. Yeah. And uh, it it was yeah. cold that day. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it just got done snowing. So, yeah. but uh, it was a lot of fun. Uh, it was something I've never experienced before. And uh, Margie, who was one of the head uh, people of it, she um, she put me into it. And you know what? I thought it was a lot of fun. It was just something something to do. Yeah. Well, they showed it at the uh, mayor's uh, State of the Union, and it was uh, you came across great. Nope, you really I, did. I came into rehearsal. And oh, we saw you on TV. We saw you on. I'm like, oh boy. Yeah. <laughs> Everything you're doing, I've, all, all you have to do, you do something, and it shows up on TV, and all of a sudden, uh, then everybody thinks, all of a sudden, now you have talent, not realizing yeah. they've been doing this for uh, well in excess of a decade. Mm -hmm. and that's this part of it. But uh, in addition to being uh, a top-notch talent, future Broadway star. <laughs> You are also a uh, a med student. Mm -hmm. It uh, and how? Uh, what's your? What are your plans uh, once you graduate school? Uh, I was going with ultrasonography, so I would like to become an ultrasonographer and uh, basically have that uh, X-ray for the babies. So. Uh, kind of got it from my mom. She was labor and delivery for years, mm. and just the talk with her and growing up with her and everything like that. It just kind of rubbed off onto me yeah and uh once i learned about like oh hey you can see inside the human body that's another human i was just i was fascinated by it and so i just got stuck yeah so that'll be your that's your that'll be your mm -hmm. day job while you're uh, you're working well, your I'm way up to the uh, great white way <laughs> that's yeah it. well you're doing a fine job with everything you do i uh we really want to thank you for being here today and wish you a uh great luck at this show which i know you're going to do you're going to do you're the you'll be the highlight of the show is bert healy <laughs> You'll never fully dressed without a smile. Nobody can say it like you. Can't miss and the And then uh, we look to <laughs> forward to your uh, your future endeavors. Well, thank you thank very you. much. Thanks, Dan. <laughs> thank you.